Sound Peeps, Mwahaha coming at you with uh, Clash Royale Hardcore Challenge, sitting at 623 trophies. We're going to keep pushing on, see how far we can get without losing. If we lose, we're done. We just uh, walk away from it. Going to be hard to do. All right, we got a bunch of chests here. We're going to go through real quick. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, man, I'm already going into a battle. I wasn't ready for this. All right, going up against a level four. Have no idea what his name is. And he's going to come right in with the giant, as we see a lot of these people doing at this early stage in the game. And uh, he's got uh, minions coming in too, so he's going to put some damage on my tower. Uh, but uh, I'll be able to come back a little bit. And uh, now he's got uh, that pesky uh, mini P.E.K.K.A. coming in, but uh, he's going to get just one hit off on my tower. Enough to put a little bit of damage. I'm going to put my Valkyrie up here so that I can uh, kind of take away or tank, tank up some of that damage from the knight. And since I've got the push going in, I'm going to go ahead and put um, my other guys right there. I'm going to have to fireball to clear out all of this. Ugh. Not a great start. Well, I've already taken down his, uh, his tower, so that's not too bad. And uh, he's got a giant coming in. All right, so he's just spent on that giant. I'm going to be able to get a push going here and then uh, hopefully take out his, uh, his king tower. And, uh, well, maybe not. Uh, maybe not. And so let's, uh, let's put that there. I'm going to put my Valkyrie over here to try to distract those uh, minions, which isn't even going to work. I'm playing terrible right now. Uh, was not uh, ready to get into this battle here. Um, no excuses. Still got to win. And, uh, alright, so, if he can just ease up a little bit on these attacks, I can get a good push going. And, uh, that's just what we're gonna do. We're gonna start out with the giant right here. We're not gonna put him all the way back, just in case he decides to drop some troops, so that we can kind of distract a little bit. And he's gonna put out his giant right there, which means I've got to take him out rather quickly, which I will do. And uh, let's put uh, the musketeers back here to take out those. Let's fireball all that so we can get that giant through. We need that giant, uh, and he's not going to get through. But we are going to put uh, we're going to put the knight right here and the goblins right here. I've got damage going on his tower. I think I'm going to take his king tower right here and get that three three crown. Woo! Uh, all right, so. Uh, let's get back to opening up those chests. Uh, at least we got one open, so that opened up that spot for the three, for that three crown, and we can start rolling with that chest opening up to get through the rest of these chests, being careful not to click through where the battle button is, and, uh, let's see what we can upgrade. All right, we got, we got some achievement. That's gonna help out a little bit. We got enough to upgrade that Valkyrie. We got 20 cards, so we can claim that achievement. We can come in here and see uh, let's definitely upgrade that valkyrie that's going to be great a level four valkyrie pretty strong and uh, go in here and really there's nothing i want to buy i don't have enough to get that uh, loon so we're going to skip out on uh, buying anything else that mini pekka wouldn't be a bad decision right now if i was using it but that's only if i get one more card i think i'll be able to um i think it needs uh, two cards to level for the first level four cards a level for the second so uh, i'd have to buy a couple of those and i don't really want to spend uh, my uh, gold on that right now i think we got a pretty solid deck so all right let's go into this again now we're actually ready for it of course this <laughs> famous last words uh all right going up against a level five gig, 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 gig something rather slow push is going to start here with our musketeer and so he, usually your opponent will push on the right side. We're pushing on the left side so that uh, he's got a chance to build up his force. And he's coming in with that uh, giant skeleton, which is not going to make my day very fun. Uh, I'm going to probably lose my musketeer and uh, my, and my uh, two archers. And so I've got the knight going in. I'm going to give uh, the goblins a chance to put some damage on that tower. They are going to drop it down quite a bit. And uh, we see another uh, uh, skeleton army user. We're going to clear out most of that just like that. 
If I had the Valkyrie up, I would rather use the Valkyrie than the Fireball, but uh, did not have the Valkyrie. I'm going to put the uh, Musketeer back here so that I can put damage on that dragon without that dragon putting any damage on me. And I'm going to try to knock down that giant as quickly as possible. I've also got to try to distract these minions if I can with that knight. And they are not going to get distracted. They're going to put uh, some hurting on my tower. And I think unless he's got uh, some kind of way to wipe this out, I should be able to take out that tower. And uh, he's going to come back in with that uh, giant skeleton. Luckily, I've got my um, Valkyrie ready. I'm going to put my Valkyrie there just behind it. And uh, not very smart. I uh, would not have put that... Uh, that uh, arm, uh, skeleton army up against a Valkyrie. Not ever. Um, that Valkyrie will just work that, uh, that uh, skeleton army. Well, okay, so I was going to put the giant in and take out uh, and go in for that king tower. Instead, I put the, the uh, musketeer down to take out that uh, baby dragon. And here comes the three crown. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of Well, I don't even think I needed to fireball. Well, fireball may not have been a bad decision. Um, but anyway, there's another three crown. We're doing great so far. Steamrolling through this. Let's uh, back out of that and get right into the next match. Uh, for those of you guys that are watching, I will be live on... Uh, wow, look at the bright on this side of my face from the window. I will change that in just a second. <laughs> And I uh, got a giant coming in. Great. Uh, and uh, also got a uh, bomb, a little uh, a bomber. So I got to take out that bomber before I put down uh, my goblins because my goblins would just be wrecked by that bomber. Now I've got a good grouping going in. I'm going to add the prince to this uh, attack. And he fireballs, bad fireball. And uh, yeah, he's got nothing going right now. We may get a quick push in here and get this uh, three crown. Uh, rather quickly going up against level four uh, of the friends clan I have no idea what that uh, what that name is um, but uh, this is a good game all right again we're still seeing even at uh, now, now with these level fours and level fives they're putting their um, they're starting their push right at the bridge which means the trade space is going to be on my side of the map never going to work out well for them all right let me change this real quick And that should be a little bit better. Add maybe a little bit of light from this side. And dim light. Let's go. There we go. All right. Heading into hopefully, um, uh, well, this should be our last match of the morning. Hopefully not the last match altogether. Up against Colpix. And let's see how Colpix wants to play this. Let's see if I can get my uh, slow push started with my giant. Yes, I can. And uh, he's going to get a slow push with his giant. Both level 3 giants. I think my giant's a level 3 anyway, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I don't think I have any rares that are above that. And I'm going to get uh, my musketeer back here. And uh, let's see where our, our trade is going to happen, I think, on my side of the bridge, which is goodness. And so we're going to be able to get a good little uh, buildup right here. And oh, man, I need my Valkyrie right now, but can't get her out in time. So I'm going to fireball all of this. And that's going to do a little bit of help uh, to get this pushed through. And now I'm going to go ahead and get my goblins in. Ooh, not a good time for the goblins because he brings in that Valkyrie. I am able to clear out that Valkyrie with my Musketeer, but uh, we'll have to keep in mind that he has uh, that skeleton army so that I can... Uh, keep that Valkyrie at the ready. Um, Knight was a good counter for that mini P.E.K.K.A., bringing him, of course, into the middle of the map uh, so that I can get the additional damage from uh, my tower. And now we're going to come in with that giant and uh, would not be surprised if the next thing he comes in with is the skeleton army. So uh, reading your opponent is absolutely crucial. So I knew he was going to come in with that skeleton army. That's why I put the Valkyrie back, back there behind and uh, now he's got his little minions doing some work. And uh, he's also got a Valkyrie, so I've got to be mindful of that. I'm going to go ahead and just let a little bit of damage happen. Uh, well, I didn't get any damage on that tower, which is not uh, great. Now that uh, I've taken out that Valkyrie, I'm going to get that uh, 
goblin, or I'm going to get those goblins going in. Uh, he's going to go ahead and try to push right because he knows he's losing the tower on the left. I'm going to distract that knight, pull him over here. Uh, guess what's going to be coming after that giant? Yep, there they are. I'm going to go ahead and bring in uh, my Valkyrie back behind that, and uh, he's got no chance at this. Um, when your opponent has you pretty much pegged, uh, not going to be a great day for you. And uh, I don't mind saying it. I've pretty much got him pegged. All right, so we're going to go ahead and take out this tower. We're going to see, uh, oh, is he rage quitting? Or is he quitting? Uh, we're going to go ahead and push in on the king tower and uh, see if we can just wipe this out. Make it a uh, triple crown day. Uh, yep, there we go. Triple crown. So that's how you do it. Uh, just uh, you know, keep your keep your focus on your deck, um, uh, building up the cards that are really going to do the most for you. And let's see what we get in this crown chest. Uh, four gems. That's not bad. I'll take that. And I don't think that's going to allow us to upgrade anything that we have in our deck. And I am holding off on upgrading anything else because I'm trying to get this deck as beefy as possible. We are now up to 741 trophies. Let's update that trophy count. And uh, not too bad. I'm pretty happy about that. I'd like to know how you guys are doing out there if you are participating in the Hardcore Challenge. And, uh, you know, if, if you are, uh, feel free to link your uh, video in the comment section below. Or um, you can send it to me and uh, message me and, and we'll get in touch. And uh, I'd like to play uh, highlights for you on this channel. Uh, let me know how it's going for you. If you have any recommendations, you think any changes I should make in the deck, let's talk about it. Uh, thanks for stopping by and watching the feed. I will be live on Twitch TV slash Mwahaha Martin. Uh, M-U-A-H-A-H-A-M-A-R-T-I-N today from 9 a.m. probably till about noon and I will be playing through uh, my legendary deck offering some uh, deck help and if we can get enough people in we'll even run a tournament or two. All right guys uh, keep it uh, keep it uh, uh, keep it keep it here keep it tuned here anyway whatever uh, thanks for watching Mwahaha. Bye.